Hello and thank you for joining me. It's Thursday the 3rd of October. I'm using my Rider Waite Smith cards today. Um, so let's see what messages they've got for us as we've uh, just moved through that little eclipse portal and we're out the other side. Hmm. Okay, who we got? Oh, that's a lovely card to start with. Okay, we've got the Ten of Pentacles. And I said this yesterday, didn't I, that when we're around new moons and full moons, we always get moon-related cards and we've actually got the moon. I feel like I want to talk about gratitude today. I feel like uh, for some of you, it is going to be abundantly clear now what the message or the theme was as you move through that eclipse portal. But I feel like yeah, we all need to be grateful for something, even if it's just getting out of bed, you know. Um, the Ten of Pentacles comes in when we are feeling really good about our life. Um, I don't feel that this necessarily will resonate with everyone, that they've got everything they need, which is the sign of the Ten of Pentacles. It's that abundance. It's such a, you know, a rich scene, isn't it? We're in the vineyard. We've got the castle. We've got the money. We've got the dogs, you know, we've got everything. But I feel like this is an acknowledgement that you're now on the right path to get those things. And here is this right path, the moon. Remember the universe, when we have an eclipse um, season, we get put where we need to be. So, you know, our, our lives transform in some way, whether that's a spiritual awakening or an aha moment that you've been thinking perhaps not helpfully. Um, you might move away from people, situations, places. But I do feel now that there's an energy and an understanding that, okay, I'm at the start of a new path now, okay? And that start of that new path is here. But I feel the moon is coming in just to remind us that, and I think I said this yesterday, we don't just go to bed on the night of the eclipse and wake up and go, oh, that's it, brilliant, I'm transformed. It takes a while. And with any astrological event as powerful as that, the moon is going to still affect us and the, you know, the, what's going on in the universe is going to affect us for a little while. So I want to say, be just aware that you may not understand everything yet. Some of you will. Some of you are going to get this and go, yep, I'm there. I know what to do. I'm going to go off in this journey. I don't know where it's heading for me. I don't know what I'm going to meet, but I'm good with it. And some of you are still going to just kind of need that little bit of time to come round. But wherever you are, eventually we are all going to start journeying on this new path, this new adventure. And we did say, and we've, we've said it as a theme really for the last... Um, three or four weeks that new things are going to start to happen. But I do feel that it's starting from a good place. And I feel that Ten of Pentacles is that good place. Um, whether or not that is financially abundant for you or just the idea of, wow, I am now in charge of my finances. I am now aware of how I can make myself more money or you've you've cut I feel like some of you have cut ties with people that maybe have been a bit of a drain on your energy, time, money, or all of the above. But I do feel there's a gratitude here that we are on this path. The moon comes out sometimes it can be really confusing and we don't know we don't know where we're going, we don't know what we're doing, and we and we can but that's that's okay. That's okay. You know, we we'll get there. Um I feel like we're all in it together. I feel that everybody that watches these, wherever you are in the world, is understanding that actually this is quite a powerful place to be, walking into the unknown. I'm not going to break into song. I know that, weirdly, I was doing the ironing a couple of days ago and I put Frozen 2 on. I'd never seen it. And that Into the Unknown is a song there. And I thought, oh, okay, this is a sign. Someone made me watch this. <laughs> <laughs> but um, Disney Plus, that's who made me watch it. Anyway, I hope that message resonated with you in some way. I will be back again tomorrow as it's Friday. I'll use my animal card, so please come back for that. And if you would like a private reading with me, then just click on my uh, link to my website and it will take you to the book a reading page. Um, and you can yeah connect with me one-to-one -one and have a, an hour reading for just £45. So... I hope to see you there. If not, I'll see you back here tomorrow. Bye for now.